of the war on drugs comes out of retirement to take over a fledgling drug task force. John Berkey has taken command of the Brown County Drug Task Force. For many years, Berkey ran the Cincinnati Police Department's Pharmaceuticals Diversion Unit and most recently the Warren County Drug Task Force. In a story you'll see only here on Local 12, Rich Jaffe shows us how Berkey plans to do it all over again. Lunchtime's always busy at the tiny Harold's Quick Stop in Georgetown. Kayla Boggs has lived here for all of her 23 years. Today we weren't talking daily specials. I asked about the drug problem in the area. How bad is it? It's really bad. That's all I can say. I mean, it's everywhere you turn around. A longtime veteran of the drug wars, recently retired from leading Warren County's Drug Task Force, this week, John Berkey took over command of the Brown County Drug Task Force. There's heroin out here, big heroin problem, there's prescription drug problem, and we still have meth labs. So, I mean, it's, those are probably the three uh, biggest issues, but there's a lot of folks uh, addicted, overdose, dying, uh, that, that, you know, smaller population, mm -hmm. but per capita probably the same as Warren County. Berkey's a nationally known crime fighter with a major track record here in the tri-state. He says he has faith in the tiny team he's got and those he's assembling in Brown County. It's really not me. I, I mean, I can help organize this, but the, the, the guys and gals that work, those are the guys that really make you look good. While John Berkey is appropriately optimistic about the difference his drug task force can make in this community, some of the longtime residents are not nearly so sure. Dope in this area comes out from Cincinnati along State Route 32, known around here as the Heroin Highway. It also comes across the river just a few miles away. Nick Ring's a local defense attorney, and he's not hopeful. The problem is so bad here uh, and in the surrounding areas, I'm not sure if one person can make a difference or not. I really don't know. Um, heroin is something I'm dealing with in a, in a professional basis on, on a daily basis. In between the chili, chicken salad, and sandwiches, a serving of pessimism. I don't think anything could help. Really? Really? You're that... It's not going to go away. It's just getting worse and worse. At the end of his first week on the task force, though, Berkey's feeling pretty good about the future of the Brown County battle lines. I'm far less concerned about it on day five than I was before I came here. In Georgetown, Rich Jaffe, Local 12 News. Berkey takes over the task force at a rather interesting time. At the end of the year, Brown County will have a new prosecutor, a new sheriff, and also a new coroner.